my primary goal is to improve the quality of life of women with pelvic floor disorders. Um, these are common conditions and women can often struggle with these for years before coming to the physician. And I want my patients to feel comfortable with me speaking about these very personal symptoms and concerns. I also strive to educate my patients about their problems and all the treatment options available. So I'm a urogynecologist and my clinical focus is pelvic floor disorders. That includes problems such as loss of bladder control or bowel control, as well as prolapse. Prolapse is when the vagina or pelvic organs actually drop down and bulge into or out of the vagina. These are very common problems and over half of uh, women will have a pelvic floor disorder at some point in her lifetime. I truly strive to improve the daily lives and function of, of my patients. As a woman myself, I personally understand the concerns and priorities that women have. I understand that my patients want to be active and exercise and go to church and spend time with their kids and grandkids and travel and just go about their daily lives and not be incapacitated by their symptoms. I offer a really a range of, of truly cutting edge and innovative therapies for pelvic floor disorders. I'm one of two fellowship trained urogynecologists here at MUSC, and I'm currently the only one offering um, surgical therapy for prolapse using the Da Vinci robot technology. Whenever I perform a surgery, my goal is really for any type of surgery to perform the best procedure in the safest way and the least invasive way so that my patients can get back on their feet and back to their lives because I know that's their priority and that's their goal. Fortunately, not every pelvic floor disorder requires surgery, however, so there's a range of other therapies I offer. Um, sometimes the best treatment is behavioral or lifestyle modifications, an office-based procedure, medications, or even pelvic floor physical therapy. So I'm often talking about a range of treatments with my patients. I'm a native Charlestonian. I grew up right here in Charleston, um, so the cell was easy for me. I went to uh, Duke University for my undergraduate education, and then I went to New York University for medical school. I stayed at NYU for my residency, which was in obstetrics and gynecology, and then I did my fellowship training back at Duke um, in female pelvic medicine and reconstructive surgery. Um, but I was born and raised right here in Charleston, and I knew I wanted to come back to the Lowe country for my practice.